So <laughs> uh, he's hollering a little bit because we've got, you know, uh, an extra cameraman here. But I, I usually let her hold on to me a little bit. And you have to hold her, to cradle her, you know, toward her back end here, the softer parts of her belly. And you feel something in here. You will feel the bladder, and then you can just give it a squeeze. And it's real easy. And sometimes I have to hold her tail up a little bit to make sure it doesn't dip down in. And you can just sort of work on it here. And you usually don't have to squeeze very hard. It, it's pretty simple. And uh, I know she, she's just a very vocal cat, but that's real easy. And now, to make her go the other way, you can feel her intestine, and you feel little little balls of fecal matter in there. And, and we'll see if she has to go. I, I squeezed her pretty good last night. She might not have to. But it's kind of a two-hand thing. I'm using my left hand here. I don't know if you can see my thumb. But I'm using my left hand here to try to work it down toward the back. And then as it starts to come out here, you just kind of pinch it off. And I know it's a little gross, but again, it's either that or it goes in the house. So I don't think she has to go too badly this morning. And, uh, and that's how I squeeze my cat.